Boone County prosecutors have charged a Columbia woman after a child allegedly died while in her care last month. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Lucas Geisler. And I'm Morgan Burrish. Court documents say 56-year-old Sarah Brown is accused of putting a baby on her stomach in a crib with a loose, unfitted blanket while she was running an unlicensed daycare with more than six children. The baby had a lung infection, and Brown allegedly ignored her parents' request to lay the child on her back. Brown is charged with involuntary manslaughter. We've had reporters all around Columbia as we continue to learn more about the infant's death and the woman facing charges for her alleged role. Now Brown was scheduled to appear in court today, but she was released from jail on bond. We're kicking off our live team coverage at the courthouse. ABC 17's Marina Diaz was at the courthouse today where Brown was expected to appear in court for her hearing. Marina, you went to court, learned Brown had already posted bond, and you also spoke to the prosecutor, told you that this is a felony charge. Morgan Lucas, Sarah Brown has been charged with first degree involuntary manslaughter for her alleged role in the death of a three-month-old baby. And that felony charge could see her face anywhere between three to ten years in jail. But the baby's grandmother says the family wants to see those charges upgraded. We went that fault that Monday. She went to this new daycare on Monday, and by Thursday she was gone. A Columbia family continues to mourn the loss of 12-week-old Ayla Gibson who died in the care of Sarah Brown. Brown was operating an unlicensed private daycare when Gibson was found dead in a crib. She allegedly put Gibson in a crib with a loose, unfitted blanket and pillow in a position that resulted in her death on May 25th. Brown allegedly lied to police saying that she had found Gibson on her back. I spoke with the assistant Boone County prosecuting attorney who told me Brown's first degree involuntary manslaughter charges are a class C felony and could see her face between three to 10 years in jail. Under Missouri law, a person commits the offense of involuntary manslaughter in the first degree if she recklessly causes the death of another person. Gibson's grandmother, Tambra Redden, says these charges aren't enough. Um, I would just like to see justice. I would like to see this continue because involuntary manslaughter, when you willingly laid her down on her belly, is not suffice to me. Morgan Lucas Brown bonded out of the Boone County Jail on a $15,000 bond. She is expected to be back in court on July 11th. Reporting live in Columbia, Marina Diaz, ABC 17 News. All right, thank you, Marina. Brown's next court appearance is going to be for her arraignment. Now, Kamarowski asks that if you or anyone you know has any information related to this case, contact Crime Stoppers at the number you see on your screen.